Hello, I'm Jerry Rigg, and this is the Dusters Daily Challenge for October 2nd, 2018. Looking at yesterday's leaderboard, a total of 23 players, with LB taking the top spot at 985, thanks to generous sentries and, well, maybe not too generous, but average generous sentries and no damage. And, yeah. Decavoid took second spot with 965. Taking a little bit of damage, but ending up with uh, ship scan, even though he didn't quite get much from the sentries. I was at 945, followed by Mystica at 925, Marvin 885, the Integrator 779, Jupaka 755, along with Handy Food, Adam Wong 246, a 700, and Longfellow Player 685, with, wow, Dano in 14th with a 385, and Dargard in 19th. And I knew this would happen to people with a 60. Uh, I'm going to assume for Dargard Swarm. Because, damn. Probably the same for Dano as well, actually. That Swarm could have been at a much worse time, and if you removed that radiation earlier, you could have had a bad day. Today we have transport and remote power, along with very good drone health. Two infestations on a private B. And I don't need Drone 2 to come out right now for power. So I'm going to leave it at that. Oh, the entire ship is powered, so I don't have to worry about it at all. We have two infestations. Okay. R6. Something died. And that should be this door. Alright, give that a little bit more time. What? Now! Now there's two infestations, so I definitely want to, uh to move a little bit. Because I don't know if the other infestation is slime. Oh, that's clear. Okay. That is slime. Shit. Awesome. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I'll give it till three. One of those rooms must have a defense as well, so if I can actually check seven and nine and verify those are safe, then I can... Uh, verify that the uh, extra turret is, or the extra defense is in R8. That's an ideal circumstance. That's fine. Yeah. 
right? Yeah, all right. All right, defense is in here, so this must be clear. Which is the worst case scenario. So we'll give that to, we'll give that about 45 seconds, I think. It's a long wait, but I'm not LB. I don't have that kind of what's but to sit in front of D7 and just wait for uh, a leaper to walk through or not walk through. And that's a big enough room that you won't know until it's too late, basically. Well, I mean, you, you would be able to back out of a door if it was trying to close, but it's not really... You're not going to be able to see in the room. Like, I could do R9. I did R9. What? What? You are so needy right now. What did I say? 515? All right. Well, that's... Oh, Jesus Christ! I was waiting for something to jump out at me. And as soon- I mean, the transporter was in that room, even. But as soon as I drove through it, it did the graphic thing. I thought something was jumping at me. Oh. <sighs> Alright. Now let's see where this is. I don't have anything good that I could see in R4. If this isn't R5 or 6, I think... Yep. Meow. What? You have food, you have water. You just want attention. I'm talking and I'm not talking to you. That's the problem. Yeah? Alright. I'm not going to bother with... Uh... It's not going to matter if there's anything in R4 anyway. There's nothing I can do about it. While I have two transport signals up, I'm going to go ahead and try to leave. Not that it makes a difference, I don't think. Three scrap, one propulsion fuel. Starting score of 600. And that was it. Total of 680. And what the hell with Echo Fig? And that must be ship scan, but where was the fourth one? Huh. That's a little bizarre, but okay. I checked, you know, I probably should have checked the rooms that didn't have a signature first, like I did yesterday, that actually worked out really well for me. So I would have found the slime earlier and might have... What? Oh my god, stop! And uh, might have been able to get further into the slime room and see something that they were able to get or actually all things considered uh because positioning could be different because of the uh transporter even with one generator it can change things that could have had an effect as well so if you haven't done your run yet good luck if you have leave a comment with your own experiences and strategies for a ship like this uh, did you check the slime room first because it didn't have any motion in it and get lucky that's that's pretty much the main designator right now I think and uh, what the hell with echo fig I mean that must be that must be ship scan which would be very nice on a ship like this especially with only three or four scrap yeah and then the integrator is 620 which means they didn't get any scrap a little surprising there if you'd like to check out 
check out other videos, you can see Marvin Copper, Dano 416, LB, Mustika 21, Dargard, Decavoid, Murkowler, Corntoth, and Agenta 1999, all listed in the video description. If you enjoyed, do please like, and have a good day.